welcome back to another Let's Play of Civilization V with me, DeWaldo. So, uh, last time the sound didn't record, I apologize for that. Um, it's kind of ticked. But here is where we're sitting. Um, let's get rocking and rolling. I've been doing a little bit of thinking. Japan is a problem, but we don't have the worst army, and we're actually not doing the worst in the game. Now, I did a little off-camera experimenting, and though Japan you know, isn't our best buddy, there is a little something we can do. Hey Japan, why don't you declare war on the person with, you know, oh, gems? I can certainly do that. Um, I think it's worthwhile to get Japan out of my hair. I can start focusing on other things. And also take Brazil down a peg. And I can do something else. So he's declared war. Let's check Almaty's quest. Oh, they want to denounce Japan. Well, <laughs> they did just declare war on this other sieve. I might wait just a little bit. I don't know if... Uh, this will go away if another uh, sieve declares war or uh, denounces Japan, but I'm just going to wait it out just a pinch. Let's kind of skirt around that barbarian encampment. That's very good. All right, those gems are hooked up. I think that one happiness can, uh, can last a little bit. Now, I've also been reading some of the comments. What should I do with this worker? Is it worth buying a tile to up production? I've got that stone quarry hooked up. Man, Mausoleum of Halicarnassus would work pretty well over here. Um, I don't feel like spending the gold just yet in case we need it. So I'm going to go ahead and just make one more farm. And uh, some of the comments by a uh, user named Jagger said, uh, finishing our social policy tree in the uh, direction of, uh, what were we going for? Let's see, will this open it? Ah, sorry about the screen scroll, there we go. Finishing Liberty, of course, unlocks a great person of our choice. That means it can be a great engineer, which means I can nab some of the wonders I've kind of had my eye on. Uh, let's just park you on the hill. Should be very good. Okay. I also purchased a pagoda with my faith. You can see uh, my religion believes. I decided to go with tithe because it's so very strong. Um, I really want to play to my strengths here, and I believe that getting massive amounts of gold is definitely a strength for me. I'm going to try and spread my religion a little bit. Um, I, I kind of looked at a few guides, and I'm not sure... Uh, See if we can dodge that barbarian. Okay, good. I think we can. Not sure the best policy. Uh, I believe going and converting city states is going to be in our best interests because a a lot of them will have quests uh, wanting the religion, which is good. And b, um, you're I'm not going to cause diplomatic penalties. Okay. There's our barracks in Madrid. Now, what to pump out exactly? I wanted another military unit, but I don't think Japan is as big as a threat right now. I would actually like to do a little bit of exploring. So I might pump out a second scout. Something to be said about Colosseum, Temple, Lighthouse, everything is good, but... Two turns for a scout, a scout that starts with XP, sounds like a good deal to me. Now I think I will uh, 
All right, there's horseback riding. I think I might just go until, hmm, I, I have to start preparing for work in a little bit. Okay, he still has Salvatore. I still have the quest to denounce Japan. I'm gonna wait that out until the bitter end. <laughs> But I really want to fulfill that quest. I think it'll be so strong for me. Now, where do I want to go tech-wise? <clears throat> um, theology, I can start rocking and rolling. I haven't unlocked... Uh, I haven't unlocked any of these things yet. Um, I need the correct social policy. Uh, also, getting currency up, I think, is going to be a strong move for us. I don't have iron connected, so I can't really get swordsmen. I think beelining for currency is going to be strong for me. Okay, let's scout. Ah, oh, and it looks like that uh, goody hut has been popped. So no goody hut for me. Let's actually look at worker placement in... Oop. There's our scout. Worker placement in Seville. Because we're up to two citizens now. One's working the two food, that's great. One's working the three food, that's even better. So it looks like I'm growing pretty quickly. And I already have a circus here, do I? Because I... I have a uh, horses in Madrid. Yeah, I must have done the circus. Um, let's get even more of a happiness buffer. We don't need the faith. Actually, caravanissary. Do I want that here or in Barcelona? Hmm. Coliseum, caravanissary, walls. Everything is good. Everything is good. Well, I'm going to hook up the spices pretty soon, so I don't think I need it. Um, and I have a lot of things to build in Barcelona. So I think I will go for the care. Wait, no. No, no, no. First, I should uh, trade route overview. So let's see what the best one to be had is. A ship from Madrid to Almari. Oh, and that's way more gold than the others. Though it would be good having a caravan so that I may send gold to, or send production to Barcelona. I think I'll unlock that by the time I need to, by the time I can get the workshop to send production. I think. By that time, uh, I will have an additional trade route. So I think I'll just go for the cargo ship. Get just a little more gold to go in. Perfect. There's our second scout. Well on your way. Okay. One more turn. Just one more turn, Mom. Don't worry, the episode won't end after... After that, I'm just going to uh, kind of do it in two parts. You won't even notice. Okay. Antitena. Oh, Antitena ter 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 Terivo. A. City state. We found a city state. And hopefully, we can find a natural wonder. Now we're at 320 gold. I kind of wanted to get the uh, library unlock in Seville. Then I could be working on the uh, National College. A powerful option. Is it time to start hooking up our city? Perhaps there's something to be said about that. Uh, when am I going to get the next call border growth? Oh, did I just get the next border? Yes, I did. I unlocked those sheep. So let's get that going. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, that reminds me. How are city-states? You want wine. Wellington wants gold and sugar. I can offer a little bit of gold. Almaty. Two turns remaining. Okay, so I have to denounce Japan kind of now or never. I'll explore up a little bit. Okay. No world wonders over there. Is it worth settling? We have a river, we have wheat, we have fish, and again, lots of desert. <laughs> Kicking myself in the butt for not taking desert folklore. Thank you, YouTube, for making me regret and second-guess my decisions. Always a good time. Always a good time. Okay. This will be the last turn. And... Yeah, I'll do an embassy with you. Or else you'll just keep bugging me. Keep bugging me. Okay. Japan, I don't agree with your war with Brazil. I think it was... It was uh, ill-advised, so... I'm going to denounce you. I believe... Oh, okay, hopefully... Hopefully it kicks in. If it doesn't, I'll be super pissed. <laughs> I needed that. Keep the explore train a going. Does that, does it tick in? Come on, yes, it does. Almaty was happy for that denouncement. And Barcelona got their got their spices, so they're happy. Now, will a gift of 250 gold bump me to allies? Hmm. Huh. Sorry, let me check. 40, 30. Okay, you know, I, th I think I'll do that. Boom, allies. Now in 20 turns, I'll get that military unit, which will, you know, help protect me against the, uh, the Japanese invasion that is sure to come. And I keep exploring. I'm sitting a little bit prettier than I was before. I'm a little bit happy. Happier. I think that's it for this time, though. Um, I, feel, I feel it worked out a little bit. So I'll see you in just a couple seconds. Okay, and back. So here's this lovely screen again. We're actually fifth for soldiers, and that's because I did a little off-screen playing, like I so often do. Uh, we were gifted a bowman by our uh, lovely now friend, former ally, and we built ourselves a horseman. So we're not doing too bad all in all. Uh, unfortunately, the war with between Japan and Brazil has ended. So, I mean, eh, it could have lasted a little bit longer. It could have gone a little bit better. Um, I ended up building a missionary, and actually I'm going to turn this back to saving for a great profit, I think is a fine, fine idea. Now, I've been kind of considering where do I go with this person, um, and I think sticking to the high population city-states, because I don't know... Actually, if I flip Rio, that's a lot of gold. And I don't think they're in the running. Let's just check the religion screen. Um, 
so what do we have for world religions? Buddhism, Eastern Orthodoxy, Protestantism, and Shinto. It looks like Dutch Byzantium, so Dutch I might have to worry about. They're doing really strong right now. And who has Pantheon beliefs? Pantheon, Roman, okay. So I, I'm guessing it's Rome that's going to have the next world religion. I don't think we'll have to worry about Japan or, ooh, Kyoto, that's strong. Japan or Brazil. So I might actually send them that way. I mean, if you're not friendly with people, let's actually first see if we can get open borders so as not to waste. There we go. Don't waste any uh, power with our missionary. Good, good. So off screen, I've also done a lot of exploring. I found these two city-states and kind of gotten in a little miniature battle with a barbarian encampment. Um, I should, re like really, I ought to just pass this by and keep exploring, but there's nothing to the south and I have to go north anyway. So I would, I could like edge my way around this encampment, anger Bogota a little by going through its territory and probably get attacked, or I could just clear it and, you know, gain friendship with both Bogota and uh, this one I can't pronounce. So I'm going to do that. Um, as you can see, I was beaten to the Oracle. I was also beaten to Petra, which was a huge disappointment. Uh, Tech-wise, I am right now doing engineering, but I kind of want to do guilds. Uh, engineering, because I could get that extra trade route, and it's, it's going to happen really fast. But, um, let's see. It would be good to stretch our happiness a little bit more, but... I don't have any of my cities connected yet. That'll happen soon. In fact, I might I might go ahead and get another worker somewhere. So I think I'll finish engineering and then go into guilds. Hopefully I can finish uh, Liberty by then. Yeah, start that golden age. Hopefully first of many. And let's start the second wave of overseas exploring. Right, right, with this guy I was going to check for barbarian encampments. So that's it for that turn. Whew, yeah, a lot has happened. A lot is happening. I think it's time to get the road, though. I've done a little calculation. Let's see how many tiles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ugh. That's a little worse than expected. Eight, that means 16 gold. You know, I don't know if it's worth it until I get Barcelona's population a little bit higher. Other ways, otherwise, I'm just going to be paying a lot for those roads. Uh, Seville is population four. And I think growing a little bit. Yeah, nine turns until the next one. Actually, let's uh, let's check your citizen management real quick. And I forgot to start my timer once again. Oops. Oh well, it doesn't matter too much. So, citizen management working there. I guess that's good. And workboat in five turns. Yeah, I'll lock you there because I'm going to build a farm there really soon. And get a three food tile. Soon I'll also get the workboat. We'll get another three food tile. Antwerp, your allies to the Netherlands, don't know if I agree with that. Okay, let's see how far I can go. Oh, looks like I can only go that far. Yeah, I don't know if I'll find anything here on the east coast. I think it's all going to be west coast. And it, does, it doesn't look like Japan is being too bad. Um, man, they've really kind of pushed their city out. Uh, I should try and secure this area next, but I don't have the happiness quite yet. I will once I get the uh, my crap back from Japan. But currently, no dice. So let's stick you on a hill. 
and oh, well, that's what I should be doing. I'm yeah, I'm going to attack with my uh, scout before that barbarian encampment spawns another unit. Uh, major defeat. You know what? Why don't I just work my way around? Yeah. Work my way around and take back that barbarian worker from Bogota. Or for Bogota, rather. Um, I'll still keep exploring in the sea with that scout. Sounds good to me. Alright. So, I... What's long-term plans for me now? Besides... Getting a bunch of gold. See that gold jump up. Right, right, right. Yeah, another Shinto city. Wonderful. Very good. Um, long term is really boost the hell out of Barcelona. Man, it's going to grow again. This city is just going to become a powerhouse. They're going to be so good. And then when I get that uh, stoneworks, I'll just have one extra happiness and a little bit extra production. I might start purchasing some tiles, though I don't think I'm in too much. Yeah, I've got city-states up here, and they're not really going to go past the river. Rome, however, you can't even work tiles over here. If you buy one more past the river, then I'll just go on a buying spree. Yeah, I don't know if I want to do a major defeat. I'll anger Bogota for a little bit. And see where that gets me. But I, I really need to find those world wonders, man. I am really hurting for some world wonders. Do I send my worker back to Barcelona? It might be a time for a road. Let's see how many tiles. One, two, three, four, five six seven so one more than ideal and I want Seville to grow a little bit more so it looks like you're going back to Barcelona and yeah move to that tile and we'll see when you get there ah you've just got a warrior there might as well clear you out You move over to Kyoto. Okay, let's see. Oh, you could do better than that. I Yeah, let's just do Okay, what's the base gold? Whoa. Is it 240? Yeah, 240 I think is the base. I'll take it. Nice. We've also got libraries everywhere. I uh, quick built a library in Seville. So as soon as that market is done and our gold is doing good, then boom. Turn the unit. There we go. Friends with Bogota. Maybe the barbarians will take another worker. And I could get more points. Nothing like abusing the system. Let's, hopefully we can be the one to take out that barbarian, but it's just good getting experience with uh, horsemen. They are so nice. Nice. Yes, they didn't quite kill him. Oh, we're down to one happiness, it looks like. And... who? Behind in, is that tech or social policy? It's not too far behind, but more behind than I want. Nice, it's national college time. Great, we finished that in Barcelona. What did I want to build? A worker might be good. Four turns, yeah, that's not bad. Market is actually going to be really powerful. Yeah, we. I'm not in desperate need of a worker. 
Good, finish my work boat. Uh, market would be good as soon as I can get all the markets up. Then I can, of course... Where's my work boat? Trireme. So let's send you over here. Try and get some EXP for you. There's my work boat. Let's hook up them fish. Boom. There we go. So Phil is looking good. And get that guild guilds going. My tech rate's actually not doing too too poorly. And it looks like this might be all of the westward expansion I can do until I unlock seafaring. Which is a bit of a sadness. Yeah. Let's kind of just peek around the edges. Uh, maybe north here. I doubt it though. And of course along this coast we can try and discover where Theodora is. That might be the best bet. Or take out Barbarian Encampment. Also a good call. And we've got you on the East Coast. Hopefully you can discover something good. Great Barrier Reef would be so phenomenal for us. Ah, oh, Machu Picchu finished. I actually really wanted that. Ugh. Uh, looks like that brute attacked my scout. And I will spread religion to Kyoto, which will probably make him a little bit mad. But we'll see. Get my gold up. Damn, I've almost got 500 gold. I might just spend that on something. Can I take him out? I can, I, I believe, hopefully, is it worth it? Yeah, uh, if he spawns a unit, then I'm definitely boned. Yeah, and I don't really, I mean, I need a worker, but not right there. It looks like both, yeah, yeah, ooh, that's strong, strong move. Got two more city-state allies. Strong, strong move. All right, what tile are you working? Are you working unimproved tiles? No, you're working all improved tiles. Very good, good for you. I could do one more food or, you know, I've, I've got gold to spare. I've got gold, I could out and out buy a market here. Which isn't a bad idea, but I don't know. I like I like the idea of city-state allies. Even if I don't have the... Uh, okay, citizen management. What did I want exactly? Oh, buy tile. That's what I wanted exactly. I could buy this one for 75 doubloons. I'll do it. Let's get production up a little bit more here. Then we can do some shenanigans. As for you, to explore over here. As for you, good, you finished the spices. Oh, we are sitting pretty. I can build farms over here. Could be good. We could also connect. I'm still waiting for a little more population. So, how about one more farm? Good, we got our uh, fishing boat up. And our cargo ship finished its trade route. Yes, I'll go for Almadi for the 10 gold. There we go, 35 per turn. Man, they're really pumping out those wonders. I just can't get those techs fast enough. I haven't even discovered guilds and Machu Picchu has been built. That would have been really, really nice. The faith, the gold, the great merchant points. Uh, East India Company, however, should be a relatively easy nab. Mostly because uh, I don't know how the AI prior prioritizes markets, but I feel that um, I should be able to sneak some one in. 
and a settler would be a really good seeing as I'm sitting at 14 happiness now but where do we want to settle I think definitely this way uh, grabbing that gold might be nice mm-hmm we could get that luxury resource we can kind of close off the south um, hmm if we have we could get a western city over here um, buy up tiles to get the iron and gold because this is a six iron deposit yeah and of course gold is gold we would have the deers we would have the whales we I think we could have the fish but most importantly we would have western coastal access which would mean this island could be ours which I think it will be there's a pretty good some pretty good river spots some pretty good ocean spots maybe even right here get the fish get the wheat get the sheep get the iron all pretty strong and uh, I'm still thinking of down here I mean it's like not the strongest spot but now we know we have two fish tiles we have a whale tile we even have unexplored island over here that could be anything that could be full of that could have natural wonders and everything It'd be the strongest tile in the game who knows probably not but whatever keep exploring aha yes let's gain some experience uh, can't attack so we'll heal up oh they stole it from us you bastards I needed that gold Bogota is giving us even more horses great that's what I needed thank you <laughs> but I mean something's better than nothing attack that ship keep exploring oh maybe there's something there how long until I finish National College oh, that's okay can I speed that up not really I mean I could start making lumber mills and get our production up we have such a huge food base here maybe even start running some yeah he takes it from the fish no lock the fish lock the fish take it from I'm tempted to take it from uh, the dyes because this just gives us oh this only gives us two gold Actually, this is probably our weakest tile. There we go. Lock the market. Start uh, getting some great merchant points. Where can we see the progress? Nowhere. It's nowhere to be found. And great merchants are. Would be a pretty good idea. And I mean, you're going to grow in four turns anyway, so. Oh, you're signing research agreements, eh? I could get on board with that. How's our uh, standing with Rome? Okay, they don't covet our lands, that's always good, and kind of strange with Rome. They do a lot of coveting. It's not great. I'm kind of like our luxury resources are quite sparse I don't have any doubles other than the die which I, I could get another die hook that up maybe that would be strong give us a little more to trade I also could get a double of marble maybe that's a uh, a strong move for us running up on my time here but I feel that we've accomplished well a little bit more than previous times maybe maybe it's already turn 130 and I have no natural or I have no uh, wonders to my name none at all and thus ends the golden age oh I didn't even know there was an archer there. <laughs> Didn't even know. 
And yeah, no. Doesn't look like I'm going to find anything on this coast. Open borders? What do you think? What think you? Oh, I don't even have an embassy. Jesus Christ. No way. That's stupid. What about just one? I'll do, sorry, I'll do one gold per turn. Because that is a fair deal. I can, I think I could spare the one gold to turn. We'll take the open borders for now because exploring is kind of my thing. Let's settle in. I think the hand axe can't hit us, but just get some vision over here. And even if they can, I mean, that's a little more experience. Yeah, sure, I'll take an embassy with you if you're not going to invade me. That would be great. Let's do... Oh, man, they're lowest, and we're kind of in the middle. I'll take it. Double shock, sounds good. Minor victory, sounds good. I think he did attack my trireme, so let's send that trireme home. Back to Seville. Barcelona, you finished the market. Um, Aqueduct, get a little bit of growth going on. I can do that. I can do that. Let's explore over there. Good, we got our farm up. Is it time for a road? We've got five population. Maybe like to get a second worker before I get a road. Maybe it's time to buy a tile and start selling resources. Get an extra dies hooked up. Oh, yeah, heal up with you. Four turns to guilds. I think we could get East India Company. I kind of, like, I need, I kind of need East India Company. Just a little bit. Good, good. Shrine in Seville. Hmm, 11 turns for a worker. 16 turns for a market. I'm going to prioritize that for now. I wish this would finish just a little bit faster. Can I do that? Is that a thing? Eh, not really. No, nothing I'm worth, I'm willing to do quite yet. I want that settler though. Make hay while the sun shines. Don't think you can kill me. Maybe I'll move back one tile and heal. Just be super extra safe. Mm-hmm, makeshift alliance, that sounds good. And it looks like Netherland is uh, picking up a bunch of city-states. No fair, man. That's my... That's my gig. That's what I'm doing. Alright, send you home. And heal you up. I'll have to keep an eye over here, make sure they don't spawn like a ranged unit. That would be bad for my horsemen. Good, and the gems to Nobunaga just ended, which is perfect for me. Oh, maybe, holy shit, I have 700 gold. Why don't I just out and out buy a settler? I have a lot of buildings and crap that I kind of want built. So, boom. And I think this is a good place to end it. I'll have to contemplate where exactly I want to build 
my city, but it's looking like West Coast is the place to be. Uh, it sucks having like tons of kind of shitty, unworkable desert tiles. Um, the other, the other one is on this desert hill. I would have a little more, little more workability, a little more food to get me through. Uh, but I would only really get the gold and the iron. No whales. Over here is looking like even more and more. Not only do I get channel access, but uh, whales, fish, and I mean the tundra's not too bad. Just gotta clear that encampment out. But I think somewhere over here is going to be a good move for us. And hopefully get us a little bit ahead of the AI. I'm super happy that Japan has, I think, taken a big hit from the war. And I'm getting a lot of religious spreading and whatnot. Kyoto. Ah, oh, no. 12 pressure. That's no good. Well, until next time, take care.